you look at the driver's side this one is also like very low and uh, I'm going to take out the seat so it has like uh, four bolts uh, actually there's like uh, two nuts in the front and then two bolts at the rear so you need to have power first before you could remove them because um, there's no access actually so you need to like move the seat backwards to access this one and then after this one is taken out you have to move it forward so that you'll have access at the back so 16 mm bolts are out you could like uh, push this out forward maximum so that you could access that bolt funny because i could take this bolt out by hand <laughs> And then the other side, there's no bolt in there. Crazy. Yep. And then this one is also wrong. It's like this this label should be inside. So I need to fix this one too. I'm moving the seats uh, rearwards now so that I could have access to that. See that one is, uh, this one is not uh, blown actually, but looks like it was partially blown I guess because the tensioner is like retracted I'm going to disconnect this plug again and I'm trying to find out that the mystery connector on the passenger side I cannot find it here so I'm just going to pull this one out And then I think they did some uh, troubleshooting over here because the the wrap is uh, gone. Same thing with this. And I think the only problem is the pretension. Oh so, yeah, comparing these two, if you look at that, yep. So this is retracted probably by an inch. And if you look down here, you compare both. is all the way down there so this one partially exploded before I got everything back I just need to clean down here I'm going to put the seat back in and then uh, put the ground terminal back in the battery and then clear the codes you need to clear the codes I did um, I put a 2.2 ohm resistor to simulate an airbag and uh, yeah it uh, once I put it in um, the uh, the code went away for the uh, left side uh, side airbag I think the uh, the connector is bad on this one um, I think the uh, the side airbag for this is probably okay uh, now if you look at this um, there's actually like a uh, a shorting wire it's not focusing there's actually a shorting wire in there that uh, when you put the plastic um, it will actually like uh, um, it will move so that it will be an open connection uh, but when you take out the plug it will go back and it will like short circuit the connection so probably because the i think the previous owner when they removed the door card for this one i think they probably messed up the uh, the socket or the plug and that's why i have a faulty airbag like um, if you look at this I think they don't know how to open it up they probably forced it so it's kind of mangled yep. we got the same story on the other side on the passenger side there's no clip in here so what will happen here is that it will be like a it will be like a, a closed circuit so yep and this is not the proper way to do it with the airbag connections yep so i'm gonna find a connector for this yeah uh, i think the airbag is okay i don't know how 
Yeah, I think this one is probably this should be over here, but I don't know what they did. But yeah, this is also bad. Yeah, we also got missing bolts. So I got one missing here and then one over here. Okay, now I got my uh, airbag light to turn off. So the issues were uh, caused by the by the mechanic or the previous owner or any DUI person that disconnected the airbag incorrectly. So when they disconnect it, uh, they broke the uh, the plugs. So there's a plug there that actually like disconnects the uh, the what they call that the uh, there's like a circuit or a or a pin out there that um, shorts out the the airbag actually both pins are being shorted when you disconnect it so when you reconnect it there's a plastic teeth out there that separates that pin to the connectors so that one is broken uh, when they disconnect it um, I could see that they actually messed up when they replaced the door cards I think when they're trying to replace the speaker or probably anything that involves uh, removing the, the door cards they messed up actually the 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 airbags so yep uh that's pretty much a diy that pretty much gone wrong so yep nice that uh the light is off so uh the only thing that that shows up here when i turn on the car is the four by four light but that goes away actually and it's like weird so i might probably have to deal with the steering angle sensor later on but for me Whenever I turn it on, I mean, when I turn, when I, whenever I drive the car, it just goes away. So there's nothing wrong with it. And the 4x4 still works. So, I mean, all the, all, the all-wheel drive still works. So it's not really a concern right now. That's it.